Here, bringing you uh, Fortress Craft Let's Play 1. I've recorded this a couple times, Lost the World, so I figured I'd go back on there, mess around a bit. Uh, I learned some more things, which is why this is coming to you a couple days after. I know uh, you guys might have already known this stuff, but I'm going to go through just in case you were wondering like I was for a while on uh, basically how this game works. Um, right now I want to go ahead and say it's kind of like in a beta form, kind of like how Minecraft was when, well, it is, um, new things are bound to come out soon, new things are happening, and everything is not working well, and, uh, one of the things is if you join someone's world, you lose yours, is what, you, and that's what I did, you know, I was like, hey, let's, and so, uh, but me and my friend have a world now together, that we play on um, I think he's he's two hours behind me so he's not home yet he's at baseball practice or something so um, oh, it's night time so uh, as you can see I've got the little ray gun here um, and I got jump boots he was doing a lot of relic hunting I was building for you guys but um, we went relic hunting we uh, did a lot of stuff um, one of the things that I did is I, I got water working and uh, I'll go show you guys that but uh, what I like about the ray gun is if you're clearing out an area you can just spam you guys can hear that the LB and RB buttons and just will dominate things and it's got a really good range I think I, got, I, think I, I can get that right there in the lab boom but uh, so I like building in this area. As far as I know, each world is almost the same, or there's at least a couple different kinds. In my first world, I had the same area all carved out, and now I have it all carved out again. There's like some stuff here, and you know, boom, boom, boom. But, um, oh, my water is gone. Huh. Well, this was full of water, believe it or not. But I guess I can show you guys how I do it. So this is a hot tub. I've got lava down or magma, whatever it's called. You need a keyboard, a USB keyboard or a chat pad. And you hit shift, it pulls up this. And you type in add uh, water space I am not A-F-R-A-I-D. I am not afraid. Then when you hit shift, boom, water. Now you've got water. But see, the thing is, is I'll go ahead and show you. Uh, you're in water now. Now you're not. It doesn't go down. Oh, whoops. But yeah. So, um, I've been playing Minecraft, I think I've got like an hour or two logged on, or maybe a little longer. So, um, what I do is I double the water up, add water, I am not a R-A-I-D, boom, shift, and whatever you're pointing at, and, uh, the reason why you want to type I'm not afraid because it, it will keep going and uh, I had an ocean <laughs> over here but apparently the water is not there or if it wasn't there I doubt it's gonna be here but I had yeah if you see all this was water but uh, I'll go ahead and show you what I mean though it, it, it just it takes over everything so I don't know what else you can do. You can type in help, and there's the commands. So a help shows commands: clear, clear screen, display message, set position, spawn, instant objects, set time elapse, set the TNT size, add a single block of infinite water, fill a 
cube it cubit I think cube ID Kubo ID I don't know set the maximum players FPS counter time ruler we'll, we'll type in FPS FPS oops FPS do I have an FPS counter I do well that's how much do I have shit can still have it yep well guys that's FPS I run at not bad, huh? Fast game, I guess. Um, but see, if you just type in "add wat water," like they say, it says adding water is not supported over the network in Chapter 1.0. Adding water is very risky. Ensure your crosshairs are angled where you want the water. You can easily flood the entire world, and there is no way to remove water currently. If you are sure, then and and her the command add water I am not afraid water oh whoops I add water I am not afraid oh shit where am I there we go and I, I don't know they say it doesn't work too well I, I think it does if you just gotta have it pointing at what you want and it will just keep going and then you'll have this little pond thing and it it, it goes pretty fast and then like I said I, it will stop once in a while and apparently there's, and stuff like that will happen it won't but uh as you guys can see um the keyboard you want to have a keyboard if you're gonna play this game. Luckily, I have plenty. Um, so uh, today, I think I was just going through and making a deck, and so yeah, we've got a hot tub, we've got a little pond. Um, oh, I've got a TNT detonator. If you guys want to go see TNT, that's how I cleared this whole area out, and then I looks pretty nice, huh? Not bad, you know. I'm out of buildings, not my strong point, but uh, I think I did okay here, huh? And we'll do that. It takes a little bit to blow up, but I guess. Well, you, know, you don't have health, but. Well, look at that, we're at 60 frames per second. But yeah, that's what TNT does. Nothing new, really. Let's lag the game, shall we? I don't like this mountain, by the way. In case you're wondering, yes, I'm mountain racist. That's gonna blow it all to hell, isn't it? Um. Oh, there we go. <laughs> wow. Look at that. Any relics? Can I find any relics? There's a mine system or a relic looking system. Because really, that's all you can hunt is uh, relics. And there's a trick to doing that. I don't want to take any credit. I did look it up. But I didn't know. I did notice how you could do that. How it. But uh, let's go ahead and show you my house. Blue carpet. I know it's not really carpet, it's canvas. I use it as carpet. Brick interior, or exterior, red, and this is marble. Looks kind of cool with the red canvas or carpet, as I like to call it. But, um,. So I'll go ahead and show you guys just a quick trick. I'm not gonna go relic hunting unless there's one like nearby. And I think I see one over there in the distance. But yeah, you do this. You put a block over your head. You look around. Nothing new. I uh, just could go ahead and go over it for those who didn't know. And as you can see, yeah, my friend Tyler was digging and digging. Although he didn't find too many relics, to be honest. Um, ah. but um, 
So yeah, I was just wanting to show you guys how the USB keyboard works, how you add water, and um, so yeah, so this is uh, the Let's Play I was thinking of doing. Um, I'm going to show you guys some more uh, multiplayer stuff. I'm going to record it today, not until later in the day, probably at like 9 o'clock my time. And so this video, I might start editing and syncing the audio right when I'm done. I want to go ahead and do it, and then I will send it off to YouTube, and I'll do. Um, so that should be this should be up a couple hours if uh, I stick to my word. If that, yeah, probably about an hour. So, um, yeah. So, if you guys were thinking of getting Fortress Craft, um, I've said it once before in my uh, Team Gamer episode four. Uh, if you guys want to see that, if you missed it, check it out. It's on my channel. Um, or I think it might be to, like the right of the page it, while you're watching this, you know where it says like related videos I think I might come up there uh, Teen Gamer episode 4 talk about your Call of Duty talk a little bit more um, uh, I think I mentioned Gears Beta in that one I'm not sure which one it is and, um, uh, but yeah so this is my Fortress Craft Let's Play enough talk about that um, that's all for the Teen Gamer episode I'm going to record in a second. I haven't been doing a lot of recording, guys. I've been, I've been watching a lot of, uh, videos. And I haven't been playing either. I've been playing Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, the multiplayer on that. It's pretty fun. But, um, yeah. So that's where I've been. But, uh, I'm going to stay true to this. I'm going to try to record at least and... I know I'm going to get an episode a week, but once every other day at least, hopefully. I don't know, there's not too much you can do in this. Um, you know, it's basically me doing this. But uh, I like the wood in this game, it looks real cool. Um, and I'm got a couple more minutes left uh, but yeah I like the jump booths so you don't get stuck at all Just got one, two, three, four. so um, this is how I make a tree I, it looks like a tree. It smells like a tree. So, uh. Yeah. There. Tree. Look at that. Ain't got to see a better look a tree than that, sir. Um, so yeah. Just gonna go ahead and showcase you my tree. Oh, crap. No. But, uh, I, I, I like to put these around it. It looks kind of authentic-y. So yeah, there it is, a tree. So uh, this is just about it for my Fortress Craft Let's Play Part 1. Um, go ahead and recap. I showed you guys how to make a tree. I showed you my house. I uh, showed you how to make a hot tub. I showed you how to add water. You put an FPS counter in your thing. 
And yeah, that's about it. I'm just running over a little bit of 15 minutes. If you guys haven't noticed already, I uh, I don't I think it's called a promotion or a partnery kind of thing. Uh, as I know it's not a partnership completely, but a, my I can put longer than 15 minute videos on there. I think I've said this before, but yeah, kind of cool, you know. But uh, that's about it. We'll end it with me jumping on a trampoline into an ocean. <coughs> so that's it, guys. Have a nice day.